this redstone clock will shut off in one year. Not one Minecraft year, one real life year. How it works is that every day that goes by, this changes, which updates the observer, sending on it pulse through these repeaters into this redstone torch, which will unlock this hopper for one second, allowing the item to pass through here, and allowing one more to go into the hopper, so that's always at a constant 64 blocks. Once it gets more than this, see there's a 63 over there instead of 64, which means that this chest will have to fill up completely. It will cancel this redstone, unlocking this redstone torch, pushing this piston into here with the other daylight center sensor and restarting the whole process over and over again which that means every one of these things is 48 Minecraft days. The first one over here is 48 days, then it goes to 96 days, then it goes to 144 days, then 202, 250, 298, 346, 365. If you're wondering how I got 346 to 365, it's because with a system like this, you can actually set the amount of blocks in here to be less to equal exactly the amount of days you want, which in this case would be around about 19 days. I don't, I don't know. But yeah, that's 19 days. Yeah, it's 19 days. And so that means in 365 days, the redstone torch will be unlocked, pushing a redstone output through here, and unlocking this door, but nothing behind it. So if you really want to go through this door, then I guess you're going to have to wait 365 days. But that's all I have for today. Make sure to subscribe if you want. And like the video if you want to see more of these redstone tutorials. But anyways, thank you all for watching. This has been Sai, and I am out.